Hi, Vanessa. How are you? Hi, Anne. I'm fine, and you? Same. Would you like come with me to the library? Sure, with pleasure. Which library you want to go? That's a large, three-story library next to the metro. Did you know the one in which you can find a lot of international literature? Okay, I get it. We're going there by bus or we're going on foot. Let's go on foot. The weather is good today. Okay, let's go then. The weather is really wonderful. Vanessa, are you dating someone? What do you mean? You have a boyfriend. No. Why? You're so pretty, girl. It cannot be that no guy has offered you to date yet. And I was offered more than once, but I always refused. I don't need it. Why? Because I'm lesb, that is why. You're so brave and I've always liked boys, but sometimes I imagine myself next to girl. <laughs> Vanessa, tell me how I understand, maybe I'm lesb too but don't know about it yet. Don't worry, sooner or later you yourself will understand what you want. It's like choosing between vanilla custard or chocolate cream cake. No big deal. Well, here we are. I need fine books on Chinese history. I think they're on the third floor. Let's check it out. I also need find some information for my homework. What exactly do you need? On the history of France. <laughs> I think you find this book on the first floor. Hello, can I help you with something? Hi, I would like to get a library card first. Do you live in the area? Yeah, here's my ID. You can see my address on it. Thank you. Here's registration form. Please fill it out and write your full name below. Here, take it. My registration is ready. May I have a library card now? Of course, here's it. What kind of literature you're looking for? I need some books on Chinese history. Can you show me where to find them? All books about China on the third floor on the most distant shelf. When you get upstairs, you need to go past computer science room and then turn left. It will be on the last shelf on the right. I see. Thanks. I will try to find them. I've got one more question. And my friend looking for literature on French history, where she's can find them? She's need search on the lower floor. All literature on France is in the second room on the right. Okay, I'll tell her. But first she needs get library card. Otherwise, she will not be allowed take books and take them home. Okay, thanks for information. I'll tell her. Vanessa, you know, while I was choosing the literature I needed, I couldn't stop thinking about our conversation. I realized that I really like you, and I would really like to KS's you. And what you're making up. Come on, we won't do this. Because firstly, I have a girlfriend and... And secondly, you're very emotional now. It's not done that way. Wait, you have a girlfriend? Yes, and we're very close. I don't want to deceive her. Although, I like you too. What should I do? I didn't expect such an answer from you. I'm so ashamed. Bestie. Stop crying. Don't worry, I'll think of something. How can I not worry? I open my soul to you and you. The library is not the place where this conversation would be appropriate. Okay, let's do it like this. I'd like invite you to visit. My parents said I could invite friends over anytime, even overnight. Are you free tonight? Yeah. <laughs> I'd be happy to visit you. I just need to ask permission from my parents. 
Great, now take your books and go home. And in the evening I'm waiting for you at my place. I'll tell my mom to break her special cake. Good, we could bake something together. I know how to make delicious muffins. Great, I just have a cupcake decorating set. Sounds tempting, see you then. Hi Anne, how are you? Everything is good, thanks. You? Same, please come in dad, Anne is here. Hi Anne, we are glad to see you in our house at any time. Come in and make yourself at home. Thank you, Mr. Woods. I really like your family. Be why the way my parents said hello to you. Thank you. That's so sweet. Tell them I said hello, too. Sure, Mr. Woods. Here is our living room. This is the biggest room in the house. Since we spend a lot of time here and guests often come to our house for dinner. The kitchen and bathroom are also on the ground floor. If you look out the window, you'll see our garden. Oh, what a wonderful garden. It has many beautiful flowers and trees. Condition is excellent, thanks to my mom. She spends hours in the garden to keep it tidy. Now, let's go upstairs, and I'll show you my room. With pleasure. This is my parents' bedroom. It's their personal space. As a rule, I don't go there. And this is my room. It's pretty cozy here. Last year there were minor changes. The bed had been moved. The desk and closet moved to the other side. Mum bought a new thick rug for this room. Now we can sit on it and play floor games. I also have Twister. And it's fun to play here. Is that the aquarium in that corner? Yes. There's aquarium in my room. This room is dedicated specifically to my turtle Harry. He lives there. I see. I really like your room. Thank you. Now, let's go downstairs and make some muffins. Good idea. We need eggs, butter, sugar, raisins, cocoa and baking powder. I think we have all the ingredients except raisins. I'll ask my mom to buy it if she goes to the store. It's an optional product. We can't make cupcake without raisin. You can add dried fruits if you have them. Yeah, there's. My grandma gave us a lot of dried fruit last week. Great, then we'll start cooking. Wait for a minute, please. I'll ask my mom how to heat the stove. Okay, in the meantime I'll make the dough. While you're cooking? Tell us where you have been in the last week. I've been in Chicago for last two weeks. Oh, now I get it. So that's why we haven't seen each others for a long time. Yeah, that's why and I'm fine. I was just looking for a normal job. Anyway, it was a bad idea. How about you? Has anything new happened in my absence? It's still good that you tried, Anne. I am sure that very soon you will find something suitable for yourself.